Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and you know the past few days, I've been talking about the Air 31 military base a lot. Yes, I've been mentioning in videos and stuff like that, and I've been mentioning about it a lot, and now, Bademo has officially confirmed what will be happening to them, and I'm going to be going over that in today's video. Anyway, before we jump into everything, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe, because it really helps me a lot. Anyway, let's just go ahead and just jump right into the video. So look at this right over here, Bademo says that the jailbreak military base has been moved with all new features so over here new defense robot machine guns will keep intruders out new layouts with larger ufo exits too nukes now deal a hundred percent damage and new neon nuke reward so look at this as you can see this is the first like image of it on the very side so it is currently right around here so as you can see that is the old military base air, old air for the one military base whatever you call it so it's probably going to be like starting somewhere around here and it's going to be all the way over to the satellites right over here so they're trying to move it all the way over here and an interesting thing is there's actually like three of these satellite dishes there's only like two in here but now there's three and there is a it's, it feels a little bit bigger but let's take a look at this a little bit more as you can see this is like the full size of it it does feel a little bit bigger but the cool thing is as you can see there is an army helicopter hold on let me just expand the image so here's a more expanded view of it and i'm just going to zoom in and show you some cool stuff so right over here we still have the meteor right over here and there is some, you know, some cargo, stuff like that. But the cool thing is, look at that. The army helicopter now spawns at the military base. I've been really wanting this for a long time because it doesn't make any sense for the army helicopter not to spawn at the military base. But now it officially does. And uh, right over here, I think this is where the nuke comes out. Like, you know, where you put the nuke and stuff like that. I think that's where the nuke bunker is or whatever the nuke, you you throw the nuke out. Um, I really have no idea what this is. Maybe this is where the air tail spawns. You know, that's like a spawning thing. And right over here, uh, I think the UFO spawns right over here. Look at that. There's like the opening capsule. So it should be a little bit bigger. So your UFO should not get stuck in it. And uh, yeah, it actually looks a lot better. And you know why? I, I don't know if I told you guys this. I think I told you guys this. But I don't currently like the latest military base so you guys know the latest military base this is area 51 and i just don't like it it just feels kind of odd to have you know like a purple box surrounding but on it and like you can like unlock it if you're a police officer you're wearing a police uniform but it just doesn't fit well i just don't like it i mean that's just my opinion though but i this one doesn't have a barrier at least what it seems like so i kind of do like it there's not some random purple box over it so yay next up we have these automatic machine guns so as you can see this is what it looks like so these will automatically fire at you if you are an intruder so that means if you're a criminal or you're not wearing a police uniform and but demo has confirmed right over here saying this person asked basically saying do you need a police uniform as a criminal and a key card to enter the force field and and Bademo says yes. Now, of course, I don't see any force fuel here. Maybe it's just disabled or something, but there is no force fuel. So I'm just assuming, like, to enter, you're going to need uh, a key card or a uniform. But maybe there is the force field. But I'm just hoping there is not going to be it. And next up, you have the nuke skin, the neon nuke reward. And uh, you will get this if you get nuked in the server. And, of course, I do have a few spare nukes. So yeah, I do have a few nukes saved, and I'll probably use them in a live stream. So yeah, make sure to join me if you want to see some nukes. And uh, yeah, you get that skin. But you know, the thing is that everyone dies 100% damage. So if you get nuked, you're going to be pretty much dead if you're not like at the corner of the map, then maybe you won't die. But if you're like somewhere in the map, like right around here, you're already going to die already. So I guess that works well because, you know, you pay it off. So you die, but you will get a nice cool nuke skin. So a nice neon nuke skin. I guess that pays off, but you know. <laughs> So, some more robbery news. So, this person is a little bit concerned about, you know, campers because this Area 51 base is pretty close to the latest robbery. So, but he replied back saying, trust us, it's not that close. But the robbery is, like, right around here. You got to drive a little bit here. And the only gate I see is, like, right over here. I don't think you can exit anywhere here. So, I guess you kind of do have to, you know, go around. But, you know, there is the helicopters. You can just fly right over. But it is pretty close. But Demo says not to worry. So, I guess I don't, I don't need to worry. I mean... It's not that far. Or maybe they'll make it where if it's robbing in the current daytime, they'll make it so you have to spawn somewhere else. I mean, they can always do that, so I'm okay with it. But anyway, if you guys don't know, Asimo has launched a Reddit called R Jailbreak Creations. And there is a creation that goes with this military theme so well that I want you guys to go upvote. And it is a, a tank. It's by Rally Subby. And as you can see right over here, this is the tank that he made for the Jailbreak Subby. 
subreddit and as you can see look at this a legit tank for jailbreak and um yes i really want this anyway here is the reddit post and of course i'm gonna upvote this i have no idea how to pronounce that so i'm not even not gonna give that another go but it says north africa in the 1940s was a tournament time however it didn't stop this from rolling in so i guess this is where it takes place and it has a driver, a turret operator, a gunner at the top of the turret, and a gunner next to the driver. And the cool thing about this is this vehicle was made for the purpose to annoy Black Hawk users. So if you guys don't know, raise a hand, like, raise your hand if you've ever been missled by Black Hawk users. It is really annoying. So imagine having a vehicle that can resist against that. And this will be perfect. You know, the ground vehicle will shoot down our army helicopter. You know, I think this is just perfect, man. And these are, you know, the extra screenshots that he made. But yeah, this will be absolutely perfect to have oh my goodness man so i would go ahead and upload this i mean i don't know if a seamless is going to add this but you know it's worth a try you know try to get a seamless attention by upvoting this and if it does get added i'll be so happy to actually have a tank of jailbreak <laughs> just imagine having you know like military parades and stuff like that just having another tank but yeah i would go upvote that if you guys want to see a tank of jailbreak it might be added it might not be added but rally subby has been making a lot of cool creations and that one is probably one of the coolest one i've seen so far anyway more robbery news the CMO says testing is going on pretty well as you can see right here but he says it's pretty difficult and this person asked like what how difficult you know power plant's difficult because power plant was quite difficult when you first did it and a CMO says harder so if you guys are struggling the power plant you might gotta practice a little bit more because it's gonna be way harder and it also <laughs> I like how a CMO says don't be surprised if you oof on your first run it's like we already know the robbery in the bag you know like when I first did the museum I oofed like a few times and it was kind of frustrating but then I got the hang of it so yeah and my username just says trust me i won't oof i mean i'm pretty sure everyone's gonna oof in this robbery maybe you're lucky and you're gonna survive one time but i bet you you're gonna oof in this robbery at least one time i guarantee it okay and also, if you guys are kind of confused, because Bademo did promise about, you know, like, having robbery news today, but, you know, they said that they're going to announce something else, and we'll save robbery news for tomorrow. So if you guys were hoping for some robbery news, a lot more of it will be tomorrow. Anyway, that is pretty much it. So tell me what you guys think about this Area 51 base, you know, like, moving over, like, it's moving over here. I mean, I kind of get it. Like, it's really close to a robbery, and, it, I mean, it looks pretty good over here, but, like, you know, I just feel like I was hoping the military base wouldn't be moved anywhere. Like, I mean, not, not moved anywhere, but I meant, like, it, it will get moved. I want it to be moved, but I don't want it to be here. Like, I kind of feel it'll be kind of cool. I mean, over here is, like, too close to the Colonel base, but there is some flatland area right over here. I mean, this will be okay, but, you know, it's pretty close to the kernel base, so I don't think that is a great spot. But maybe somewhere in the expansion map. I mean, there's a lot of space somewhere else, but I just don't feel it's right right over here. I mean, it's literally right next to the city. I don't know if, like, um, Area 51 is, should be right next to the city, because that doesn't really make sense. Area 51 is, like, very isolated from the city. But, you know, there is some space up here to add a military base, you know, some, somewhere else over here. That that will be more logical or more reasonable, because it got to be isolated from the city, but now it's, like, legit jet right next to the city so eh, i'm not too sure about that but anyway tell me what you guys think down below but that is pretty much it i'm really excited for the next update and more robbery news coming tomorrow so anyway thank you guys for watching and i'll catch y'all next time bye